My dear brothers and sisters, two-thirds of Ramadan is over, and now we are left with one-third. And we need to appreciate what's left of the barakah and the blessing of this month, my dear brothers and sisters. For those who didn't have much time to spend with Allah, still there is some time. You still have some ten more nights. For those who did not read Quran, who did not do extra prayer, who did not do dua, who did not recite no dua, it is still time, my dear brothers and sisters. The gates of heaven are wide open for us. That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has been calling us every single night of Ramadan. He is calling us to host us. So he would be the host and you will be the guest and he would honor you. He would honor you with his forgiveness, with his rahmah, with his blessing. Let's take advantage of this opportunity, my dear brothers and sisters. Let's take advantage. When we leave, when we depart this world, we will definitely realize how much we have missed out on many opportunities. We had so many opportunities to invest for our akhirah and hereafter. Rather, some of us were engaged in doing non nonsensical work, watching TV, playing cards, having sahra that is void of any meaning. It is not haram to have Sahra, my dear brothers and sisters. It's not haram. However, let your Sahra be fruitful when we meet, when you have Sahra, when you spend a couple of hours in the month of Ramadan. Focus on something fruitful, something that benefits you, something that increases your knowledge, something that gets you closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. There's nothing wrong and having Sahra, visiting friends and uh, family members. Indeed, one of the mustahab things, recommended things in Ramadan is Salat al-Rahim, to reach out to your kinship, to visit your uncle and your aunt and your cousins. You may have not visited them in a long time. Take advantage of Ramadan, go and visit them. Every night, pick one relative and go and visit them for half an hour, one hour. Because this is Salat al-Rahim, reaching to kinship, is one of the greatest recommended duties in Islam, to reach out to kinship, to visit the patient. If there are patients you know, go and visit them in the month of Ramadan. So, my dear brothers and sisters, having Sahra, it's not haram. There is nothing wrong with having Sahra. But let's have a focus Sahra. So when we meet, let's discuss something positive. Let's talk about something that can help me become more educated in my faith, more educated in my religion. 